Before we get started, man, make sure y'all like the video and comment bars down below. That's going to do two things for y'all. Number one, if we can average 8K views and we are nowhere close to that right now, but we still got time, we're going to be giving away a next-gen console, 500 bucks, or a laptop, just depending on whatever y'all want if you win. Number two, and this is the more important one, no matter what happens, every single Friday, we give away $50 in VC cash out, or we give away a video game, a copy of whatever you want, the extra regular edition or whatever. My, uh, my guy Nick Navarro won yesterday, and uh, you know, we're gonna give him, he want a copy of, what he said, God of War Black Ops. I forgot what he said, but we're gonna give it to him anyway. It doesn't matter what he wants. I'll read the message again. And the great thing about that is, number three, the bots are back in town, man. Don't believe them. Don't hit them up on Telegram. I'm not putting my phone number in this comment section. Only thing we're doing is telling y'all to hit me up on Instagram or Twitter. And the crazy thing about that whole thing is, Nick Navarro watches the video so heavily, and he rocked with me so heavily, so I'm glad that he won. Bro, the dude, he thought he had won in a previous contest or what have you, right? And he was like, yo, is this you, this real? Like, this dude tried to blah, blah, blah on Telegram. And I was like, nah, bro, that's not me. And then yesterday when he hit me up and he said, hey, it's me, you know? And I was like, yo, it's, it blew my mind because he actually won, so when the bots tried to get him, he didn't, you know, he 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 didn't go for it or whatever, but he, he confirmed that it wasn't me, and then he kept on rocking with your boy, and then you, he actually won, man. So look, that's all you gotta do is keep rocking with your boy, man, you're gonna win. And he actually won from the banner video, and so, you know, it's, it's a dope experience. I'm glad that we can give away stuff, man. And we're all that out of the way. Good morning out there! In 2K land, man, y'all might notice this this Hawks, uh, the Hawks, you know, shirt, the shooting shirt that I got on, man. This joint fire, man. This joint is on fire! This joint fire, man. Let me tell y'all what happened. I, um, <clears throat> if y'all interested in one for your team, let me know. Uh, I think I can get, I don't know what I can get them for. I think I can get them for like 20 bucks or something like that. They don't got no name on the back. It's just a little shooting shirt. And then we got the other, uh, we got the shooting shirts. We got the shorts. That you can get, like you can get the uh, this one, yeah. Here we go, Hawks right there. We got shooting shirts, we got shorts, and then uh, and we got the actual uh, joint, and they reversible too. So it's like reversible jerseys and stuff like that. And it's got Hawks on both sides, just in case y'all want to know. So we like uh, Gambit. I got. I'm trying to see if I can get you one for Cleveland and all that. But you know, that's all we got for that, man. But look, this joint is fire. And uh, if y'all interested in them, let me know. And I, uh, you know, I'm gonna get them. I get them for y'all to hook y'all up, and uh, you know, we put them in the store, or whatever, like that. And this is authentic NBA stuff too. So like, like if you um, if you actually looking right here, boom, look at that, wow, officially licensed by the NBA and all that stuff, super dope. Anyway, let's just get to the news, man. Check it out, that boy Swante, he started off and said, "2K got dudes losing their mind." Remember, remember, it's because the game, the game is trash, and we are all in the drought. It's just like the hood. It's not the community and that's what i'm saying man like people don't understand that that this goes on every year and it's like i i just hate that it has to be like this because once everything when the game first comes out and the views is up and everything is good everything hunky dory everybody's loving each other it's sunshine and rainbows nobody got an issue with nobody and then as soon as the views start falling a little bit which they happen every single year People start getting mad, and then it's like the community turn on each other. Instead of like rocking with each other and trying to come up with different types of content, it's like the community turn on each other, and then it's this, you play like this, and that's trash, and I play like this, and this, and this, that, and blah, blah, blah. Shut the f up. Shut the f up. Let me do what I want to do. You do what you want to do, right? And then I'm going to do what I want to do, and then we'll be well. All right. That's it. You do what you want to do, because I'm going to do what I want to do. And let's just leave it at that. You don't have to start talking about, well, this is what's messing the community up. Or that's what's messing the community up. Just like he's saying, it's like it's just like the hood. Like, like as soon as as soon as everybody not eating, then we try to turn on each other and then see who can like like my my product has gotta be better than yours, so I gotta condemn yours so I can get mine out. When that's not the case at all. It's just like uh what's 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 this fella name, man? Uh here we go right here. This, that's like uh like this this fella right here said, man. Gimme, give gimme give NYC, he said, this community will never grow because we can't even work with each other, uh, with each other. Don't wanna hear about being grown when everything going on is so childish. There's enough room to eat for everyone and don't worry about what someone says about you online. It does not affect you, IRL. And that's it, man. Everybody eats pee. That's how it should be, man. We should be working together, trying to trying to get people up there. If you if you're up, if you up 
you well you shouldn't be but you know what i'm saying if we up then we should be trying to elevate each other instead of saying instead of trying to it's just like this man we will get a lot further if you if we stand on each other's shoulders then you know what i'm saying if you stand on my shoulders and i stand up we'll get a lot further because i can also lift you up but we don't want to do that we want to stand on each other's neck if you stand on my shoulders, I can lift you up. But I got a, I got like an eight foot, eight foot wingspan, something like that. So you'll be eight feet off the ground once I lift you up. But they'll rather cut you down and stand on your neck, and that's only about six inches in elevation. And that's why we never can't go nowhere. But you know, I that's that's way too deep and too philosophical for folks this morning, man. I ain't trying to be extra woke. I'm just saying it is what it is. If I'm six four and I lift you up. You, you're going to be a lot further than if you cut me down and stand on my neck. But it is what it is. Anyway, going up the dime work, man. Hey, he says, I don't care how much wins, I mean, how much someone wins. I'm more interested in how you actually play the game. Do you play the game with actual skill or do you just abuse exploits, faulty mechanics? Um, if it's the latter, I don't care if you have a 98 win rate. And that's a fact, man. I like that's, that's, And I know that sounds contradictory to what I'm just saying. But the caveat is... If you play it, you play play the game any way you want to play it. If you want to use exploits, if you want to do all that stuff, that's fine. If you want to come out there and abuse the left stick dribble that you know nobody can't do nothing about and all that, that's fine. But just don't talk to me about it being skill on the other end. You understand what I'm saying? Like, that's the only thing I say. You can do whatever you want to. I'm just saying don't do it and then call yourself good if you're clearly abusing exploits. But in this community, it doesn't matter what somebody do, everybody gonna say you, you're, you're abusing exploits and stuff like that. And people just gonna say, you're just doing this, you're just doing that. If they playing you high and you go to the rim, they gonna say you just rim running instead of playing instead of playing well. What rim running is is what the dude was doing to us on yesterday, bro. Bro, the dude would just go to the paint with three people down there and try to stand and dunk all day. That's that's what we're talking about. Like, that's the low IQ stuff people are talking about. We're not talking about when somebody's playing you high, you rim run, and when somebody's playing you low too low, you shoot the ball. That's just taking what's available. We're talking about when somebody does something regardless of what the situation is. That's that's the only time I say is, you know, it's rim running or low IQ rim running or something like that. But hey, it is what it is. We talked about Provoke yesterday. We said, you know what I'm saying? We was against him yesterday, but I'm a I'm an equal opportunity. I'm an equal opportunity talker. I'm gonna let him talk it. I'm gonna let him talk it. And I completely agree with this. This what you should be saying right here, provoke my guy. And he says, can't even fully blame 2K. The majority of y'all content creators post for the bag and don't even try to bring any excitement to the game. Y'all make it boring too. Drop the, wait, hold on, let me, let me find this. There we go right here. Drop the mother, the mother fucking mic. Just drop it. I'm not gonna drop it on myself because this joint made of metal. And uh, you know, we're not gonna rock with it. But I agree with that, man. And the, and the bad part about it is we we as the community are just as bad because when somebody tries to bring some new flavor or when somebody tries to bring something new, unless it fits in with, with what the community is already used to, people don't um they're not gonna watch it anyway. Like, like I try to bring some different flavor with the simulations and stuff, they just don't watch it. And so I can't you can't blame the community either really that much because at the same time. You, it's not like you're just posting for the bag, but at the same time, you got to make it make sense. So you don't want to waste your time doing a video that's going to take you hours. Like some of those simulations, bro, them joints take me seven hours to do, bro. And like by the time I get to them just for 100 views, when I can come on and do a news video and get 18 times that, you know what I'm saying? So it, you just got to make it make sense, too. So I think it's I think it's mixed. It's the it's the content creators mixed with the community not want to uh you know willing is not to change so that's why when people say you got to be different or you got to do different stuff it's like nah you can't be too different because if you're too different from what everybody else is doing nobody's gonna watch that boy bruto sim on the scene wicked what up what up hey man he says this community needs help all over a game of 1v1 lmao don't be this child i, I mean it's a video game folks take the win or the loss and the dude say bro what the world what the world go back to youtube got got me messed up cheesy but cheesy cheesy as uh old 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 a get a real job them them little reviews on youtube or whatever and then brute just says bro all over of uh, all over 2k wow things must be bad in life get help and i mean that's what it is man that's a lot of time people just want to project their project their negative energy on you there's no way first of all i had trouble reading that right there but the thing is why are you mad that like bro it's a video game i have never 
I don't think I have ever lost the game and then messes the person afterwards unless it was like the uh, the very beginning of xbox when you know when people play madden when the only game online was madden and people would do would do dumb shit like like back then they didn't understand that everybody online was a so what they would do you, you can you had back then you had unlimited pauses and you could pause the game forever man the only time i would say stuff to people would be like bro i had one dude i was beating him so bad that he was gonna try to make me quit. He paused the game, walked out, left for two hours, and then came back and thought that he was gonna avoid that <laughs> whooping. Nah, he came back two hours later and I was sitting there right there watching TV and I had my headset on one ear and as soon as I heard him unpause the game, I flipped the TV back and I finished that <laughs> whooping and he had to take that <laughs> whooping too. It wasn't no way he was getting out of there. And then he, gonna, then he gonna try to say something to me real quick and then quit the game. Nah, bro, you getting the message after that? It's just crazy that people do stuff like that. And so that's why they that's why you got all these safeguards that exist in the game. Now you can only pause the game for a minute. You only get three pauses, all this stuff like that. Because people used to pause. Even in Madden, you used to be able to pause the game while somebody was running a play and everything. Bro, it was crazy like that in the beginning of Madden and all that. But you know, people used to do used to do stuff like that. That boy Sid came back and said, bro, this is light, which is sad. If your inbox looks anything like mine, this generation is doomed. I feel you on that, Sid. But uh one thing that we do got about the generation, man, is that boy Key Sticks, like I said, from what I can tell, he's he's legit. He says, first three-star in the world. And uh, this is what we got for him right here. Bow! Hey, that boy got 100,000 points. I sat there and watched that stream yesterday. He went from 98 to 100,000 points. Um, He did that. 500 GOAT games. And uh, he got all 20 of his joints left. The only thing he waiting on is next season to get his four more quests done and i can't i can't even get mad at it man like that's grinding right there and like i said though but instead of celebrating that and being like hey man you doing your thing people want to get mad at that and talk trash about that bro i don't understand it bro i really truly don't understand what this community be on sometimes like this dude just, all he doing is grinding he ain't saying nothing to nobody he's just playing the game and then you got people want to want to spew negativity his way like i don't know him and i don't know if he hitting anybody with any negativity but when i was in his stream i didn't get that from him man he's just a cool guy and that's it what it is if y'all know different then you show different but i don't know any different up next bro last but not bro look come on man why this is why i don't have a cat right here bro 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 what are you doing what are you doing that's the laptop and like you see the laptop fall off too that's the laptop and the doggone the um the the mac like, bro, come on, man. And last but not least, I know y'all saw this last night. That boy came straight down Broadway and committed mass. That's just destruction. Oh my Jesus. Get up, get up, mother. Woo, mother. Get up. Golly, boy. Look at that boy turn that right. Jesus Christ. Can I hit one of these on that? I don't even think y'all can hear. Hold on one second. Let me let me hit one of these. Y'all, y'all gotta hear one of these, man. One of Rack! Yeah! Rack! But anyway, that was just all uh, crazy right there. That's one of the, I had to put that in there, man. One of the craziest dunks you're gonna see. Uh, that might be dunk of the year right there. Y'all let me know if y'all think that's dunk of the year. And like I said, bro, hopefully this whole 2K community, we can get together and uh, do stuff, man. But that's, that's always been the issue. Like, it's like nobody wants to play people. People think they're gonna lose. People think they're gonna look bad. All this stuff that really don't matter, bro. The fans just want to see games, and we just want to see people play each other. I don't, I don't get into those stuff. I don't get into the wages and all that. But like, we shouldn't be beefing. We shouldn't be, we shouldn't be doing any of that. We shouldn't be demeaning anybody's content, any of that stuff. The only thing that we should be really doing, if you ain't got something good to say, don't say nothing at all. If somebody's not doing something that's a detriment to themselves, if if they are, pull them to the side. You can hit them in a the DM or something like that. We ain't got to put on our, our, all our dirty laundry out there on display, man. But anyway, that's all I got, man. Y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section. Make sure y'all comment bars um, somewhere in your comment, and I'm going to holler at y'all next time. Till next time. It's your boy, Jay Easy, a.k.a. Fresh from the Barbershop. BK, the people's town. Oh. Guys, please.